Hey everyone, welcome to the first video of my channel. Today, we're diving into the world of PlayStation 4 to uncover some hidden gems that might have slipped under your radar. That's right, it's time for 10 Underrated PS4 Games of All Time. This is part 1, so buckle up because we've got some amazing titles lined up for you. Before we jump into the list, let's talk about Metacritic scores. Now, we all know that Metacritic isn't the end-all be-all of game ratings, but it does give us a good idea of how these games were received by critics and players alike. So, I'll be sharing the Metacritic score for each game as we go along. Alright, let's kick things off with our first underrated gem. Gone Home Released in 2013, Gone Home offers players a unique first-person exploration experience set in an empty house. The gameplay unfolds like a narrative mystery as players piece together the story by uncovering clues left behind by the family that once lived there. With a Metacritic score of 86 out of 100, the game offers approximately 2 to 3 hours of gameplay. Players delve into the family's personal belongings, discovering letters, diaries, and other items that shed light on their lives and the events that led to their disappearance. Gone Home is praised for its immersive storytelling and attention to detail, creating a haunting atmosphere that sticks with players long after the credits roll. Moving on to our next title, Kentucky Route Zero, TV Edition. Kentucky Route Zero, TV Edition, released in 2020, is a surreal adventure game renowned for its atmospheric storytelling and unique art style. Players follow the journey of truck driver Conway as he navigates the mysterious roads of Kentucky. With a Metacritic score of 90 out of 100, the game offers around 6 to 8 hours of gameplay. Its narrative unfolds through dialogue choices and encounters with peculiar characters, with each decision impacting the story's outcome. Kentucky Route Zero's dreamlike landscapes and thought-provoking themes explore topics such as loss, identity, and the American South, making it a standout experience in the adventure game genre. Let's explore another hidden gem. Odin Sphere Leaf Thraser. Odin Sphere Leaf Thraser, released in 2016, is a remastered action RPG featuring stunning hand-drawn visuals and fast-paced combat. Players control various characters with unique abilities as they battle through a beautifully crafted fantasy world. With a Metacritic score of 87 out of 100, the game offers approximately 30 to 40 hours of gameplay. Its engaging narrative is told through multiple perspectives, weaving together themes of love, betrayal, and redemption. Odin Sphere Leaf Thraser's deep combat system allows players to unleash devastating combos and magic spells against hordes of enemies, providing a satisfying gameplay experience that keeps them coming back for more. Moving on to our next adventure, Zero Escape, The Nonary Games. Released in 2017, Zero Escape, The Nonary Games is a compilation of two visual novel escape room games, Nine Hours, Nine Persons, Nine Doors, and Virtue's Last Reward. Players solve puzzles and make decisions impacting the story outcome. With a Metacritic score of 84 out of 100, the game offers varied gameplay time, typically around 20 to 30 hours. Its gripping narrative keeps players on the edge of their seats as they uncover the mysteries behind a deadly game of survival. Zero Escape The Nonary Games challenges players to think critically and form alliances with other characters to escape the sinister traps set by their captors, offering multiple endings based on their choices. Let's dive into the rhythm of our next title. Synth Riders Synth Riders, released in 2018, is a virtual reality rhythm game where players ride along futuristic rails, hitting notes to the beat of electronic music. Even though it is a VR title, its Metacritic score is 89 out of 100 and gameplay sessions typically last 20 to 30 minutes. Its intuitive gameplay mechanics make it easy for players of all skill levels to pick up and enjoy, with multiple difficulty settings and song options to choose from. Synth Rider's vibrant visuals and immersive sound design create a euphoric experience that transports players to another dimension, making it a must-play for VR enthusiasts and rhythm game fans alike. Next up, let's groove to the beat of DJ Max Respect. DJ Max Respect, released in 2018, 
is a rhythm game boasting a vast library of songs from various genres. Players tap along to the beat using a controller with multiple difficulty levels. It holds a Metacritic score of 82 out of 100 and varies in gameplay time depending on skill and song selection. DJ Max Respect offers a diverse selection of music genres, including pop, electronic, and hip-hop, with each track accompanied by stunning visuals and dynamic gameplay mechanics. With online leaderboards and competitive multiplayer modes, DJ Max Respect provides endless replay value for rhythm game enthusiasts looking to test their skills against players from around the world. Let's keep the rhythm going with our next title, Res Infinite. Res Infinite, released in 2016, is a psychedelic rail shooter set in a mesmerizing cyberspace world. Players journey through stunning environments, shooting down enemies to the beat of the music. With a Metacritic score of 89 out of 100, the game offers around 2 to 3 hours of gameplay. Res Infinite's innovative gameplay mechanics and immersive VR support elevate the classic rail shooter experience to new heights, allowing players to become fully immersed in its vibrant, pulsating world. With its seamless integration of gameplay and music, Res Infinite offers a transcendent experience that is both visually stunning and sonically captivating. Let's switch gears and engage our minds with the next game. The Talos Principle, Deluxe Edition. The Talos Principle, Deluxe Edition, released in 2015, is a philosophical puzzle game set in a beautifully realized world. Players solve intricate puzzles while contemplating themes of consciousness and existence. With a Metacritic score of 85 out of 100, the game offers approximately 20 to 30 hours of gameplay. The Talos Principle challenges players to think critically and explore its richly detailed environments, uncovering hidden secrets and philosophical truths along the way. With its thought-provoking narrative and mind-bending puzzles, the Talos Principle offers a deeply immersive experience that will leave players questioning the nature of reality long after the credits roll. Let's embark on a whimsical journey with our next adventure. Monster Boy and the Cursed Kingdom Released in 2018, Monster Boy and the Cursed Kingdom is a vibrant action-adventure game with hand-drawn animation. Players control Gene as he transforms into various creatures to solve puzzles and battle enemies in a colorful world. With a Metacritic score of 85 out of 100, the game offers around 15 to 20 hours of gameplay. Monster Boy and the Cursed Kingdom's charming art style and engaging gameplay mechanics make it a delight to explore, with each transformation offering new abilities and strategic possibilities. With its diverse cast of characters and challenging boss battles, Monster Boy and the Cursed Kingdom offers a nostalgic yet fresh take on the classic action-adventure genre. Let's wrap up our journey with a double dose of action-packed excitement. Bayonetta and Vanquish Bayonetta and Vanquish, released in 2020 as a remastered package, includes two high-octane action games. Bayonetta features a stylish witch with magical powers, while Vanquish offers intense gunplay in a futuristic setting. With Metacritic scores of 90 and 83 out of 100 respectively, Bayonetta offers around 10 to 12 hours of gameplay, while Vanquish offers approximately 6 to 8 hours. Bayonetta's fluid combat system and over-the-top action set pieces provide a thrilling experience from start to finish, with players unleashing devastating combos and summoning infernal demons to vanquish their foes. Meanwhile, Vanquish's blistering pace and tight controls make it a standout in the third-person shooter genre, with players using advanced weaponry and high-tech gadgets to outmaneuver and outgun waves of enemy forces. Together, Bayonetta and Vanquish offer a double dose of adrenaline-fueled action that will keep players on the edge of their seats from beginning to end. And that wraps up our journey through these underrated PS4 games. Be sure to check them out and experience the excitement for yourself. Please like, subscribe and share the video and be on the lookout for part 2. Thanks for watching and happy gaming!